Hello everyone. In this lecture, you will learn how to uh, create ad units or ad side into Vertice dashboard. So, open your Vertice dashboard and uh, before creating ad units, uh, you have to verify your app ads.txt file. So, in the last video, I forget to tell you how you can complete this step. Uh, as you know, in the last video, we have added app ads dot txt this entries into our domain okay so but uh, you have to submit it here okay uh, here you can see uh, this is another scroll so scroll it down after that you have to click uh, on submit button okay just click on it now as you can see uh, our app ads dot txt file on this domain is successfully verified okay so let's go back and check developer website found but not responding okay uh, it is not res responding due to because we have added a cloud flare protection that's why it is not responding so let's uh, again click on it submit uh, it is not responding okay so let me i will do it later from my side but uh, in this case you have to verify like this one okay after that uh, how, what you can do you have to integrate uh, uh, stk but uh, before creating uh, banner ads or interstitial ads uh, we have to create ad needs okay so how you can create it as you can see there is a add units section and uh, next to it uh, a, there is a create button so click on it after that uh, select the uh, banner ad uh, first of all we will create a banner ad okay so let's click on it uh, scroll down and uh, name your banner ad uh, it is automatically pick up so if you want to change then change it then click on next okay our banner ads id has been created successfully you have what it is saying and then put the add unit into your app you have generated app id which you must enter the sdk initialization within your application as indicated by our official documentation below is your add unit for your integrated application is the to load the ad format okay this one is our um, uh, app id okay which we have already added okay uh, let me show you open the android project so go to the app under java under your package name click on activity then choose main activity class okay here as you can see this is our app id and we have already create a initial instance okay so no need to create a another one now go back to so this one we have already added the banner ad id this one okay so copy this one okay go back to android project and uh, go to the helper file and function file after that uh, as you can see we have a three ads id from app plugin so as like this we have to create a public uh, public static variable so create it here let's name it public static thing and let's name it voltage benefit okay side id paste it here okay it has been done uh, there is some typo in the name so this is not an issue if you want to remove the typo then you can choose other words okay uh, let's let's need wt okay fine now <clears throat> go back to documentation 
now create a another add unit id let's enter stitcher let's id okay now fine uh, what we can do scroll down and uh, click next okay this is our interstitial ads ads id copy this one back to project and create a new string static string wt interstitial close it has been done okay now go back to project to documentation and again create a new add unit id for uh, uh, reward video add okay click on it okay now press next copy the id okay back to the project to create a new string okay so name it to the blue t reward okay now press the now fine uh, there is type of reward not reward okay so fine now now uh, we will also add a another add unit id which is basically uh, this one app open okay uh, it will generate a uh, more revenue for you so use it okay so click on it press next copy the id back to the project to create a new string public creative okay let's name it wt app open id it has been done we have created these four ads id okay let's uh, it has been fine to go back to the documentation again maybe is, is there something any other id uh, there is only a rewarded to uh, no it is done uh, native remaining okay. we not need any native ads for now in the upcoming in or in futures uh, we will discuss about it okay so just for leave it okay no issue and uh, our integration part will be done in the next video